This is Project Green Frog? Welcome to my castle. You will be my guest tonight. But I... It's not safe outside after dark. Dangerous, huh? That's getting to be my middle name. Kiki, take him to the guest room. Come, little one. They'll not hurt you. I will see you in the morning. Well, okay. Stay! You're not safe in castle! Oh, nuts. Doctor is bad! Run away! Well, okay, I'll try! So, where could that secret exit be? No! Welcome everybody to Frogger the Great Quest. Part number six, and this story makes no frigging sense. No sense at all. We got a nice little bed here. We got something that says ear. What? Ear what? Hmm. Can't. Hey, come on, get a better. Does that say bat's ear? Yeah, bat's ear. All right, so we're looking for a secret egg entrance. I know it has something to do with this. I just forget how. Um. Spit on it? No, you don't spit on it. How the hell do we open that entrance? Do we jump up? No, we don't jump up on top. Anyways, I'm Cal's crazy, by the way, just in case you didn't know. <laughs> That's what I'm doing here. And we're trying to figure out how to open this. Really? Really? Come on. Okay, hold it. No. Guys. 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 You're supposed to open. You're, you're just supposed to open. Oh, I just gotta push the stupid button? That's it? That's all I gotta do is push the stupid button? Really? Anyways, there are some eye bats down here. So beware. Just, just be wary of that. You'll find some coins under some barrels, and oh man, the eye bat's still gonna come and get me, isn't he? Ah! Die, eye bat. Hey, what the hell? Why will this eye bat. There we go, finally. Took you long enough to just die. So we gotta find a secret exit around here. I don't know how we got into some weird, creepy castle. Um, can we open this door? Whoa, Mama! Oh, about time you showed up. Hi. Uh, I've got a problem with this door. Like, isn't she supposed to be my fairy frog mother and save me from problems like this? Brother. Yes, Fairy Frog Mother. But if you wait until seven, the doctor will surely catch you and use you for his horrible experiments. Yes, Fairy Frog Mother. Hmm. There must be some way to get the clock to read seven o'clock. Ah, maybe fast forward the clock. That's a fucking genius plan there, Frogger. Yes, seek it at the top of the clock tower. Good luck. Yes, Fairy Frog Mother. So, we gotta get... So, just like any other clock, you just, you know... If you want to see a cuckoo clock cuckoo, you know, you just change the time and you wait for it. You know, maybe you wait 30 seconds to see it go, you know? I used to do that. Fast forward clock. Hey, come Oh my god, I'm telling you, the camera is so bad in this game. Now we gotta climb the clock tower. To the clock tower! The clock tower. Tower. Oh, oh my god, the eye is gonna... So Actually, he is pretty tough, so just... Like, and I don't want anything to do with him, to be honest with you. No! Oh, get out of here. I don't want anything to do with him, because it's very... 
difficult to get around these friggin' stairs, especially when you get stuck sometimes. Okay, keep- oh my god, they're, they're both still coming. They're coming and coming and coming and coming and coming. Oh my god, they're coming. Please don't come. Oh, they're, they're coming. They're coming on my face. They're coming on my hands. Oh no, they're coming. Oh my god. Okay, I think we got rid of them. That was uncalled for. That was very much uncalled for. Okay, there's a platform there. Whoa, no, 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 no. Oh, damn jumping mechanic. I hate this jumping game. And this is probably the worst part of the game because it relies on jumping so much. Jumping is so important. And, um. Uh, okay, there we go. The best thing I've discovered is the hover. And then. Are you kidding me? I'm not gonna make that? No, nope, I'm not gonna make that. And. Oh my god! Don't make me mad! I fell all the way to the bottom! Don't make you mad! You're pissing people off, man. You wanna find the princess, don't ya? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh, are you kidding me? You slipped? You slipped? You stupid, slimy piece of crap. Oh my god. Do you know what this reminds me of? Except for it's much, much worse. Maybe it's not as bad, honestly. It's just frustration. But this reminds me of the clock. Oh, I can't remember the name of the level now. The clock level in Mario 64, and you just gotta climb up it and get to the top, and if you fall off, it's hell on Earth. Well, it's pretty much what this is. Hell on Earth. I'll tell you that right now. Okay. Can we, can we? There we go. Oh my god, the bat is back? I don't like the idea of the eye bat back. Gotta go see the eye doctor. Ha ha ha, the eye doctor. Okay, um... We gotta get over to that checkpoint. Oh, well that wasn't so hard. Okay. Okay, we hit the checkpoint. Not that I've ever needed the checkpoints. Never. Oh my god, the bat is back! Okay, we're up here. Okay, are we getting close to the clock yet? Like, seriously? Are we, are we there yet? Are we there yet? I think we're there. Get out of here, you stupid freaking eye bats. Piss some people off, man. You want to get poked in the face, don't you? Hey, get out of here. Get out of here. Thank you. Okay, well, here's the clock. To the clock tower we go. Oh, boy. When the clock gets hit by lightning, you'll be sent back to the future! No. Okay, what you actually gotta do is just, well, change the time. No, that's that's not right. Okay, that's 2 o'clock. You gotta keep pushing the button. 3 o'clock. That's, okay, 4 o'clock. 5. This is a weird, like, what kind of a clock is this? This is a horrible clock. It doesn't even look like it's, like the numbers are put on correctly. Like, seriously, that's just horrible. But, at least the door is opened, and now we can fall all the way to the bottom. You're probably thinking, oh my god, what about fall damage, but you know what? You won't really take that much if you just keep doing the little hover thing on your way down. So there you go, you're good to go. Now we can go through the door. Where the hell are we? The level isn't done yet. You would think it would be, but it's not. This level gets weirder, trust me on that one. Okay, where are we going now? Oh my god, we're falling down a weird hole! Ah! Oh, broad legs. Just what I need. Huh? Ah, very broad now, Mrs. B, this little one is under my protection. You meddler! Go away, fairy! Take that! This will hurt! Um, what kind of a camera angle was that? 
And like, what kind of a story is this? All of us, we're, we're in like a weird scientist castle, but then there's a witch in the basement waiting for frog legs. Like, <sighs> and trust me, what's what the what what you're about to see next will just blow your friggin' mind away. You'll just be like, what the hell is going on here? Like, honestly. The worst part is, I was lost in this thing for, like, forever. This little area. I, I got lost in here. Because, well, there's a set of doors over there. But you can go up here, and you can collect coins, and you can go around, and you can collect more coins, and you can run and run around in this stupid big circle for, like, forever. There's absolutely nothing to do here. There's absolutely nothing to do. You just run around in this big friggin' circle, and you're thinking, dum da dum, there's gotta be something to do here. But no, no, there's absolutely nothing. So, do you want, we're just gonna ignore them all and go for the door. Open the door, and now, insanity is about to happen. For years, I have worked to perfect my creations. Yes, Dr. Evil. What's he saying? Tonight, I release my greatest creation. Behold, the great metal chicken ray. Chicken ray? Like, like, this is Project Green Frog, not Project Red Rooster. Metal chicken ray? What? That's... <laughs> you said it all right there, Frogger. No, that's just one big cack. <laughs> ah, I see we have a visitor. Welcome to my laboratory. Curiosity killed the froggy. You guys are trouble! As you can see, my experiments require supplies. I need your legs for my experiments. This is where I laugh madly now. Oh no, not the legs again! It's okay, they they don't really work, Frogger. You can't jump anywhere, so... Mm, this is despicable, you know? Stinky, get him. Stinky, get him. So, basically what you've got to do is... Yes, you're, uh, yes, Fairy Frog Mother. Oh my god. Oh my god, the chicken is after me again. Holy cow. So what you gotta do, really... There we go. It's break these things. There we go. If you can break all these things by spinning on them or just hitting them really quickly. No boy, snacks be you. Yes. No. Watch it. Come on. I think I'm hitting them. Yep. There we go. We're good to go. Oh my god. This really can be the hardest part because... Where the hell did the chicken go? There's a huge metal chicken in this room. What the hell is the huge metal chicken doing? Like seriously, what's it doing? It's supposed to be getting me. Nobody's getting me right now. Oh, well this guy is. <laughs> like seriously, this is brutal. This is the worst AI ever. <laughs> They're supposed to be stopping me. Oh my god. There we go. That one's, that one's defeated. No, get out of my way, you Sorry. stupid chicken man. Look, look at the chicken man is doing one thing. He's guarding that. Okay, well that one's down. Now there is still more, even though all the ones on this floor are done. But this is the hardest part. Because now all you have to do is climb the ladder. And apparently, even though there is a ladder, the gigantic chicken ray, he can't get you. Oh, what is what is chicken power super effective against? Huh? Oh my god, no 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 no. Okay, well, we're not done the hard part yet, apparently, which is climbing the ladder. And neither can they. They can't climb the ladder, so they'll never come and get you. You now have infinity time to finish this. Infinity time. 
you can now take as much time as you want. You just gotta come up and destroy all these things, cause nobody else is gonna- Would you get up there? Yes, yes! Come on! There we go. Yeah, stop me. But nobody can. Nobody can stop me. Or nobody wants to. I don't know which one it is. Come on. Would you break? Thank you. Um... I don't really collect a lot of money, so I don't think I can afford to pay for it. Okay, come on. You can't even stand up here. There we go. And there's one more floor to go. One more floor to go. Oh my god, they're trying to stop me. Please. Please do not try to stop me. Please just let me escape. Oh my god. The pain that they are causing me is just... It's just horrible. Oh my god, look at them. Well, you can't even see them up here. They're just trying to get me. Isn't this exciting, folks? You cannot win. Um, actually, that's all I can do is win. You cannot win because somebody didn't program you guys to climb the ladder. And the chicken ray didn't really do anything when he was down there. Okay. That old chicken ray is, is not attacking. Me off. What? What? Did he say it's pissing him off? Did he say he's getting pissed off? Bye -bye. Well, that apparently opens the emergency exit, which we can now make a break for. And the chicken ray's still stuck. Yay! So we destroyed a bunch of weird machines and we escaped the huge metal chicken ray? I, I don't understand what the hell that thing was there. This is not Project Red Rooster. And even though it took a longer than I thought, we're gonna keep going. Let's see, what can we buy? We can buy the metal chicken ray, so let's do it. And we're gonna get Doctor. Doctor, Doctor, give me the news, I gotta... Bad case of love in you. Ah, uh, yeah, we want to save the game. Because we never, ever want to play the Metal Chicken Ray level again. We're going to the catacombs. Sounds scary. It's an area called the Catacombs and Dark Souls, which is a very difficult game, by the way. And it is scary. What the hell do we... Okay, you're... you're crying? Oh, poor little froggy. Alright, well, there's something smoking down here. What's smoking? Um, that's weird. Why is there smoke? Um... Um... Is this... is this a vampire? This is not Twilight. Excuse me. Oh, am I supposed to be running away from it? I, I'm really not sure. I, I'm really not sure what I'm supposed to do from it, but that was really weird. He's just like... <laughs> now he's making more weird noises. And he's huffing and puffing some more smoke. You're like a rat? You're a frog. Why are you running? I have no idea. Well... Yeah, bite me! Don't be silly. I will not hurt you. Aren't you gonna suck my blood or something? No, but I'll suck your <laughs> blood. Yuck! I only drink fruit juice. Fruit juice? Phew, I was worried. My ancestors were fruit bats. Really? Fruit bats? Ah, but there were a few vampires on my mother's side. My daughter is Princess Dar. Another princess? So we had the river princess, the fairy princess, and now we have Princess Dar? Dar? Seriously? Her name is Dar? She is lost in these catacombs. Help me find her, please. 
A princess? Sure, I'll help you find her. She'll show you the way to the outside world. Okay. So now we gotta find a princess, apparently. That's just, uh, that's just excellent. So we got another princess. You know, what they say, your princess is in another castle. We have another one here. And a funny story about Dar. Um, that was actually a word me and a friend had made up back in middle school. <laughs> and anytime somebody did something really stupid, it was like, that's what we said. We were like, like Dar. Like Dar, you know, Dar. <laughs> it was our word for you're dumb or something, I don't know. <laughs> Or, or, or stupid, but yeah, like Dar is what we said. So anyways, we gotta find the princess, and I actually found this really frustrating when I first played this game, and I might find it really frustrating again, because you gotta go through all these rooms and try to find her, and sometimes these rooms can be annoying. Um, is this where she is? No. Oh, I was hoping I got lucky right away. You know, some, sometimes you just need to get lucky. She's in one of these rooms. Is there anybody in here? Greetings, green one. I can't believe I found her already. That was very quick. Trust me, I spent 20 minutes looking for her once. Princess, I'm here to save you. My thanks for saving me from that chamber. I did not expect to meet a frog here. Hello, father. What took you? I get as lost here as you do. I was just hoping you were the princess I was looking for. This frog is on a quest to find the princess. What? So, you seek a princess. Alas, it is not to be me. You should seek out the castle to the north. There you will find your princess. But you must hurry. She is in danger. Ah, drat again. She's in danger, huh? Well, um, you said you were going to show me to the way to the outside world. Can, can you not do that, like, right now? Um, neither of you want to show me Stop. the way to the outside Oh, okay. I have to try to leave. She'll show you the way to the outside world. Oh, uh, thank you. Hey, thanks, Dar. You're a great ghoul. I mean, girl. Oh my God, with the puns. Okay, show me. Could you, could you show me faster? Um, could could you go faster, please? Excuse me. Like Dar. Dar. Da, da, da. Could you go any faster? <sighs> dum dum da dum dum da dum da dum da dum. Wow. Like, f her father seemed to be pretty quick on his feet, but she is not. Faster, please. Hello. Thank you. Could you open the ghoul door for me now? Thank you, please. Thank you, Dar. This time, quite literally, our princess is in another castle. Let's enter the frog shop. Count Blah or Princess Dar. Oh, we didn't we didn't collect enough coins this time to get Princess Dar. So we'll just get Count Blah. And in the next episode, we will continue our quest to find the real princess. Will we ever do it? Will this game ever end? I don't know. Until then, I've been Cows Crazy. Please subscribe. Please leave a comment below. And of course, Ooh! <sighs>